Hater BB. He's a BB. Hater BB. It's gonna have to do, pig. Hello. It's a minty man. He's here to do his 11 month update. He's a big boy. Guys, look at him. He looks like a two year old. I mean, we just did, we just did his 10 month update because that one was way, way, way late. So here we are. Doing the 11 month update. More on time, more or less on time. This one will be brief because we just filmed another update. But he has a couple of things to share with you guys, like how he's trying to go walking, walking. Is he trying to go walking, walking? We're all just going to pretend that the one that comes after this is not his one year update, okay? We're all in that together. We're just gonna pretend that's not happening. We're not ready to go there yet. Are you gonna have your first birthday soon? Are you gonna have your first birthday soon? Yeah. Okay, so, about the same size as he was last time. Still about, oh, 25 pounds, which just, I can't, it's, he's just a big boy. He's just a real big boy. He's just a big, big, smart boy. The biggest change I would say from the last time we chatted is that I feel like he is this close to walking. He will stand um, and just let go and just stand there. And then he looks around like, do you guys see me? Do you guys see me? Look at me, I'm just standing here. Um, it's really funny and really cute. And yes, yes. Uh, and he just looks like he really wants to walk. He is kind of bow-legged, but again, I've said, oh, we're gonna start slapping me again. I've mentioned this before. It's, a number of my children have been like that and it tends to work itself out. If I feel like it's gonna be an issue, then you know we will address it, but I don't think that it is. I think it's just uh, part of the way that, because he his, his thighs are thick and he's got a big diaper on and everything, it's just kind of part of the way that he stands. But he's straightening out more and more. Yeah. He's talking like this, like, like mumbling. This is sort of like the early stages of talking. You know, he's got something to say. He just can't quite work out the words. Yeah, but he still does say dada, sometimes mama, and he says papa. Yeah, you love you papa. Oh, yeah. Um, <laughs> he is, I've moved him to size six diapers for sleeping at night because I'm telling you, you will literally lay him down to go to sleep and change his diaper when you lay him down, like at that very moment and he still pees out of his diaper in the, uh, by the wee hours of the morning. Uh, so he just pees a lot, he just pees a lot. So we moved him up to size six diapers for sleeping at night, just to try to contain some of the, the wee wee. So, yeah, I might try, I've done overnight diapers before and stuff too to try to help hold some more, but look at this, oh yeah, good job, belly. You look like a 65 year old Floridian man, you look like, Papa Jim, you look like my Papa Jim. Yeah, you do. Yeah, you just need some of those white, you know what I'm talking about, those white shoes, the like nursing shoes, it looks like they are. Yeah. Um, he's also gotten, I've told you guys before, he's a happy baby, he's a, he is. That is all still very much true. However, I will say that he has gotten a little bit, um, what's the word I'm looking for? fragile if you will he gets piced when he doesn't get what he wants when he wants it um, and there is no distinction for him in crying because he's hurt and crying because you have made him mad therefore he will crawl over to the sofa where one of the kids are sitting and he'll try to take something from them and then when they won't let him have it <laughs> and then when they won't let him have it he just bursts into tears crying and you'd think that someone just sawed his finger off. But no, in fact, they just would not share something Daddy. that they had in their bowl or whatever. Dada. Da. Who's your dada? Dada. Dada. Where's dada? Ah. Where's mama? Can you say mama? Um, he's still very like clingy when he like whenever I come into his sight. It doesn't matter what room, what's going on, if he's eating, it doesn't matter. If I walk into the room, 
after having not been in the room with him for a few minutes, he will just start to cry and want me to pick him up and hold him. Um, so y'all know he co-sleeps and especially now, oh, we're gonna play that game, huh? Yeah, uh, especially now that we've staged the house and there's no crib in here, he's just sleeping in bed with me. And so um, I think that also, you know, he's just very, uh, he's very attached to mama. You're very, you're like a snuggle mama. You're like a snuggle mama. <laughs> you're like a snuggle mama. <laughs> um, so he goes to bed at like about nine. Yeah. <laughs> you're very happy. He goes to bed at about nine and when he is tired, he lets you know, he just starts rubbing his eyes and then he has this last little bottle and then he flips over onto his tummy and just goes to sleep. Most of the time I don't like, I don't pat his bottom or like you rub his back. I used to try to do stuff like that, but he doesn't really need it. He just kind of needs to like wiggle for a second and then he falls asleep. So that's nice. That's nice, isn't it? Oh, it's so nice. Yeah, he's very obsessed with my jewelry all the time. If I'm wearing necklaces or earrings and stuff, he's usually trying to get it. Um, he's like, I don't know what he's trying to do right now. You trying to climb is this like Cirque du Soleil? What is this, mommy parkour? Mommy parkour? Yeah? Um, still wearing 12 month size clothing. Just a big guy, just a big guy. Just a big guy. Uh, I think that he's going to be the biggest out of all three of my boys. I think that if I had to guess, I think that uh, based on information we have and also some information we don't, but I think uh, I think Noah will probably be 5'10ish and just kind of <laughs> thicker build. I think Jonah will be very tall and slender and I think he's going to be the biggest overall out of everybody. I think he's probably going to be tall like Jonah but also very um, beefy build. Like I see him having a a bit a bigger build. Um, it's, uh, it's just it's just what I see happening. What else? Are you so excited to move to your new house? Are you so excited to move to your new house? His other favorite game is to try to spill your coffee cup. So he watches for where Sierra and I set our coffee cups and then he comes over and tries to sneak and grab them and spill them. And again, he will have a full on meltdown if he sees my coffee cup like sitting on the coffee table and then, and then I see that he's seen it. So I pick it up and move it. And he looks at me and when he realizes I've moved the mug, he just starts crying. And it cracks me up because I'm like, have I ever been like, sure Benji, here, play with a hot cup of coffee. No, I haven't. But he acts like you have just taken away. He sees himself in my mirror over there, my stand up mirror. Hi, are you saying hi? Can you say hi? Hi. Hi. Da, 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 da. Da, da. He loves him some applesauce. That's sort of one of his favorite foods. Yeah, he loves applesauce uh, to eat and still just doing fantastic eating, as you can see. Ugh. Probably once we move, um, I will start to wean him off the formula, but I'm gonna wait, like I said, to make any major changes to his schedule or routine or anything like that until after we move. Don't want to take too many transitions at once. Um, but yeah, I really think, I'm so surprised. I really am so surprised that he is not walking yet. But at the same time, I'm kind of grateful for it because he's already into everything. If you leave the bathroom door open, he goes into the bathroom, opens the lid to the toilet, and goes right in to play in toilet water. Like, <laughs> and he's also, fast as lightning when it comes to climbing the stairs. Um, we had to, again, take down the baby gates for showings. And so when he can get to where the stairs are, he bolts. And I mean, you will just look over and it's like, shh, he's gone and he flies up the stairs. It's crazy. He's quite fast. Uh, he likes to dance. Um, hey, do BB-8, hey, do BB-8. Hey, do baby. Hey, do baby. He does it better when CR sings it, but whenever CR sings his hey, do baby. Hey, do baby. He could just be sitting on the floor doing nothing and he'll start dancing. Can you show everybody how you say no, no, no? No, no, no. Where's your no, no, no? No, no, no. Let me see you do it. No, no, no. You sicky, sicky, sick. 
No, no, no. Sicky, sicky, sick. No, no, no. No, no, no. Is that so funny? He's not drooling as much as he once was, which is nice. Um, I think I said that in last month's update. So that has, the, the drool has gotten a little more under control. You just are checking yourself out. You like your Florida man outfit? You're looking good, son. You're looking real good. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. What else? What else? <laughs> He's just the best. He's just the best, huh? He's just the best. Look at those. Watch out, <laughs> he'll knock your tooth out. Can you clap? Can you show everybody how you can clap? Say yay! Where's he clap? Yay! You do it. Yay! Oh, Yeah, look at that. Ah! Oh, mine. Oh. Oh. Good job, you're so smart. Good job. Yay! <laughs> but yeah, so I think I think walking is gonna happen any day. Like I said, he's he's really starting to like let go and just stand. Um, and I, I just see like he's already tried sort of once to take one step. Um, but I think we're not we're not far away from that. We're not far away from daddy. Oh, <laughs> still likes to try to bite you though. Still likes to try to bite you if he can, huh? Let's see. Ooh. Let's see if he'll cry because I just put him down. He just doesn't like it if I'm if I'm present but not holding him. Or at least where he can Hey da BB. He's a BB. Hey da BB. Go to BB. He's a BB. Go to BB. So funny, so cute. All right guys, I think that's gonna be it for his 11 month update. Hopefully by his 12 month update. <gasps> See, I can't even like look away from him. He does tantrum. He does, uh, when he doesn't get what he wants, he has mastered the tantrum. <gasps> hey. Hey, do baby. <laughs> All right, that's gonna be it for this video. I can't wait for his 12 month update and then I get to do my one of my favorite videos to make for my kids is like their montage video of um, sort of before their birthday or for him like his post adoption montage. I have purposely not gone back and watched a lot of that footage because I know it will make me cry. So that will be a fun video to film because I'm certain it will make me cry. But that is it for today's update, y'all. All right, are you ready? Are you ready to get out of here? Are you ready to get out of here? You will go downstairs. Such a ham bone. Yeah. Are you a ham bone, ham bone? Are you a ham bony? Can you say bye-bye? Bye. -bye? bye, -bye.